Are you looking for a tool that can help you better understand the dynamics of communication in your classroom? Look no further than the Flanders Interaction Analysis, FIA. Developed by Ned A. Flanders in the 1960s, FIA is a powerful tool used to observe and categorize the types of verbal interactions between teachers and students. By analyzing teaching behaviors, FIA can provide valuable insights into classroom communication. One of the key features of FIA is its categorization system. It divides verbal interactions into 10 categories, which fall under three main groups, teacher talk, student talk, and silence or confusion. Let's take a closer look at each category. Under teacher talk, FIA includes accepts feelings and where the teacher acknowledges student emotions without criticism. Praises or encourages is another category where the teacher offers positive reinforcement, accepts or uses ideas of students, refers to the teacher, acknowledging or building on student ideas. Additionally, FIA includes categories such as asks questions, lecturing, giving directions, emanders criticizing, or justifying authority. Moving on to student talk. FIA identifies two categories, student talk response and student talk initiation. In the former, students respond to teacher questions or prompts, while in the latter, students initiate conversation or express their own ideas. Finally, FIA recognizes the category of silence or confusion, which represents periods of silence, confusion, or pauses in communication. The FIA observation procedure involves using a coding sheet to record interactions at regular intervals, usually every three seconds. Each interaction is coded according to the categories mentioned earlier, resulting in a sequence of numbers that represent the flow of communication. These recorded data can then be analyzed to determine the proportion of different types of interactions. By analyzing the data, patterns of interaction can emerge, providing insights into the teaching style, classroom climate, and student engagement. This information can be used by teachers for self-reflection, professional development, and improving teaching strategies. The applications of FIA are numerous. It can be used in teacher training, programs to help educators become aware of their teaching behaviors and how they impact student participation and learning. Researchers also utilize FIA to study the impact of different teaching styles on student outcomes. Moreover, the insights gained from FIA can inform the development of instructional materials and activities, promoting effective communication and learning in the classroom. There are several benefits to using FIA in your classroom. First and foremost, it provides a, an objective measurement tool, allowing for the systematic observation and quantification of classroom interactions. This can help teachers gain a better understanding of their verbal behaviors and make modifications to create a more inclusive and supportive learning environment. Additionally, by identifying interaction patterns, teachers can adopt strategies that encourage more active student participation, ultimately leading to improved engagement and learning outcomes. In summary, the Flanders Interaction Analysis, FIA, is a valuable tool for observing and categorizing verbal interactions in the classroom. With its 10 categories of interaction and systematic observation procedure, FIA provides insights into teaching behaviors, classroom dynamics, and student engagement whether used for teacher training, classroom research, or curriculum development, FIA offers objective measurement, enhanced awareness, and improved student engagement. Start using FIA today to unlock the potential of effective classroom communication.